Friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to unzip a file on Windows 11. Now, as you can see here on my desktop, I have three files that are zipped, right? And I'm going to show you three ways how you can actually do this, right? These two files require a third party application, let's say, to install so that you can unzip them. And this one is just the basic one that you can unzip using the Windows feature as well. So the reason why I'm showing you these three because sometimes you receive some files that requires you to unzip them or being able to open them, but you might not have the necessary tool that they use to zip those files. So you'll need to acquire those in order to unzip those files. So let's start by examining this file. As you can see, the extension is .zip. It simply means that you can, it is a zip file and it's the basic zip file and you can unzip this using Windows. So how do you do this? All you have to do is just right click on that file and you will see extract all, right? So you just need to click in that and it's going to give you this pop-up and you just need to click on extract and this will extract the folder for you. And as you can see, it is done on my second screen. It is open here and then you can see the file which is there and you can open that file as well. It's empty, but you can always go ahead and open the file afterwards, right? So this is the first way how to unzip this specific file right now what i'm going to do let me delete this file now the other two files let's look at the second one here this one is a that rar it's also a zip file right but you will need to have a specific application to do that and i'm going to show you how to obtain that application and for the second file as well you can see it's a 7z which is also a zip file so how do you obtain them you can easily obtain these two tools using the microsoft store so go ahead and click the windows key on your keyboard and you want to find microsoft store if you're not able to find it under pins you can simply type in store and you should find microsoft store on your system go ahead and open that now all you have to do you have to look no, for the first file, it is a .rar file, as I showed you before. And you just need to look for WinRAR, right? And you will need to search for that. And once you look, you should find application that allows you to do that. So here is one application here, which is absolutely free. It is a BreeZip and it can allow you to... It's a RAR and zip extractor you also have this one that says zip it allows you to extract rar file as well now the tool that i wanted to show you is RinRAR. it is not actually in the windows store however you can easily obtain this file by simply going to google and if you open google you can simply go ahead and type in RinRAR, right you can simply type in RinRAR, and you should find a RinRAR application from your google search so as you can see you can find it here if you let me go ahead and maximize this browser here and you can find it so as you can see it says rinrar.com and you can head over to the rinrar website and you can simply go ahead and hit the download rinrar here so you have this option here you can simply click on that with download button and you just need to go ahead and click download right so just click the download and it will go ahead and allow you to download it to your pc so as you can see it is downloaded to my computer and i just need to click and save and install that application and that will allow me actually to extract this second file here now the second file is basically the same as you can see this file it says 7z which basically referring to that was zip by 7zip right or 7zip file so how you do that you can simply check the microsoft store as well and you can simply type in 7zip so if you type in 7zip it should basically find tools that will allow you to extract 7zip and as you can see here it brings up the breezip as well so if you click on that you can see directly what kind of file it can allow you to extract or zip so as you can see here it tells you even that it will allow you to do rar file zip file and 7zip file and you can see it. you have the instruction here you have the details here that basically tell you what kind of file or decompression it allows or it supports so rar zip 7z iso and so forth tar and so forth so forth so you get the idea however if you're looking for that specific 7-zip application you can easily go ahead and google it as well so you can simply open up your browser let me go ahead and do so and simply type in 7-zip right so if i google that you see that it finds the 7-zip website here from the google search and i can simply click on that and i can choose which one of them i want to download so as you can see it has 64 bit you can hit the download it also have 32 bit as well so whichever one you're looking for guys you can simply head over to 7-zip download this application it will allow you 
to extract those files. Now, as you can see, guys, I'm going to show you how I do it. So for example, the RAR one, I can simply right click on that because I have both of these applications already installed on my computer. It shows me the RAR, the RINRAR application here, the RINRAR tool, and I can simply go ahead and click extract here, right? Once I do that, as you can see, it gives me the folder and I can open that folder now. The same goes for the 7Z. If I right click on this, I can easily go ahead and extract that file as well. If you look here under extract, it will basically allow me to do the extract of that file. So I can simply click on that. It will detect the application and it will extract it for me, right? So because I have this one open on my computer. So the same goes for this 7Z file as well. If I want to extract it, all I have to do is just right click on it and simply click on extract all. It will extract the file for me, as you can see the folder appears, but I have both of these application on my computer, right? So if I click Windows key, if I type in 7-zip, you can see that I have a 7-zip file manager, which is that application. If I also type in RINRAR as well, you see that I have that application as well. But if you don't have to install both of those tools, as I showed you before earlier, you can use the Brizip. This is one tool that allows you to extract RAR, zip file, and so forth. And for normal files as well, you can just simply use the Windows feature to extract all of those files. And that's it, guys. Very easy and very simple.